being yourself. Everyone has good and bad points. Realizing that you are not perfect, you are a normal human being, with insecurities and failings, is the first step to feeling good about yourself. If you have healthy self-esteem and a positive self-image, you should weigh up both your faults and your good points. If you find it challenging to access our character in this way, enlist a friend's help. Ask him or her to give you an honest character assessment, warts and all. Write down your good and bad qualities and acknowledge them. Be proud of your good points, the exceptional capabilities and characteristics that make you uniquely you. But remember that some good qualities have their drawbacks. Virtues like modesty and humility can be deterrents to establishing self-esteem. Mental calm and strength, the tranquil, quiet state that allows you to be perfectly centered, gives you more control over your thoughts and actions. When faced with a potentially stressful situation, you will be aware of all the options open to you. If you are strong and calm, you can stand back, become more objective, and rationalize your feelings. Tranquility may seem challenging to achieve if you are angry, frustrated, or afraid. But if you look upon these emotions as a normal part of life and know what causes them, it will be easier to overcome them. Try to express your feelings openly whenever you can. If you do not, you may suppress them or drive them inward, directing them at yourself. By expressing them, you will be able to dissipate them wholly and quickly. This content is meant for informational purposes only. If you have additional questions, please seek advice from a professional. Like us on Facebook at the Healthy Wellness Team for more information. Thank <laughs> you.